Well, summer vacation starts today for Austin ISD. Also with the hot weather, that means a lot of people are going to be hitting the lakes to cool down. And dispatchers say they're already getting more 911 calls from the lake than they have in the last five summers. Yeah, that says a lot. And that's why first responders say they are going to position themselves with more paramedics at fire stations around Lake Travis so they can respond faster. And you play a really big role, by the way, if you call for help. You need to maybe think about naming a specific cove or a landmark when you call 911. It is a very big help to first responders. The lake is 64 miles long, has hundreds of miles of shoreline. And if we go in where you came in at, you may be 20, 30 miles away from that point. And that's going to be a really extended uh, response time for us. And officials say they do use GPS technology that can pinpoint your location, but it doesn't always give them 100% accuracy. Dispatchers also go through Lake Travis training to become familiar with the coves and landmarks and what questions to ask when you call. There's also what they have is a Lake Travis task force made up of all emergency responders, game wardens, law enforcement, and then all of them are on the same pager system. That way they can all get the same alerts and they can get them in time to quickly respond together to the water if they need to. Lots of